Nowadays, there are a lot of lead-free sodas having a list of melting temperature represented in the market. Take into account the lead-free sodas react a little differently from tin lead sodas. You have to consider peculiarities of each one. So there are five main groups of lead-free sodas. Copper-bearing euteric sodas were initially created for flow soldering of printed circuit boards. A disadvantage is high melting temperature and worse mechanical properties in comparison to other lead-free sodas. Silver-bearing sodas have been used as lead-free sodas for many years. They have good mechanical properties and are soldered better than copper-bearing sodas. These sodas are also euteric, and their melting temperature is 221 degrees Celsius. Tests for comparison between this soda and the standard lead-bearing soda show that the lead-free soda has an advantage thanks to its reliability. Copper silver tin alloy is a three-component euteric soda. It had been used long before the invention of a silver-bearing soda. Its advantage is lower melting temperature than 217 degrees Celsius. Proportion of components for such a soda has been constantly discussed to the present day. A soda having 95.5% of lead, 3.8% of silver and 0.7% of copper is recommended for bright urine project. This project showed that this soda is more reliable and better for soldering than silver and copper-bearing lead-free sodas. Stibia makes the solder appropriate for flow soldering. This solder is used in industry along with silver-bearing solders. Solder is chosen, taking into account economic reasons and manufacturing equipment. Tin silver bismuth alloy has low melting temperature that makes solder more reliable. Melting temperature, depending on different metal proportions, ranges from 200 to 210 degrees Celsius. Masushita company confirmed that this solder is the best for soldering among lead-free solders. Copper or germanium makes soldered joints more reliable and improve surface wettability. A great tendency to make solder seals in comparison with other lead-free solders can be decreased when adding other compounding materials. Tin zin bismuth alloy has a melting temperature close to that of euteric lead-bearing solders, but zinc causes a lot of problems connected with the chemical activity. Short storage time solder cream necessity to use active fluxing agents, excessive drossing and oxidizing, potential corrosion during assembling. Such solders are recommended for soldering in atmosphere of shooting gas. High-quality tin silver copper solders with adding stevium, if necessary, are recommended for assembling very important devices. Two component euteric tin and silver bearing solders can be used in professional equipment. A wide range of solders can be used for mass consumption equipment.